In this video, we will review how to use head controls to access a computer. There are a number of head control software programs available commercially. We will be specifically reviewing the SmartNav system by Natural Point, which provides hands-free mouse cursor control. This software is perfect for people who want or need an alternative to using a hand-controlled mouse, which might include people living with ALS, MS, CP, muscular dystrophy, upper-level spinal cord injuries, or people who have experienced a stroke. It's also an excellent option for individuals who experience pain or discomfort when using a hand-controlled mouse. Using a reflective marker, either in sticker form or built into a baseball cap, the user is able to control the cursor via small head movements. The SmartNav infrared sensor tracks the reflective marker as you move your head. To get set up, simply plug the USB infrared SmartNav sensor into the computer and place on top of the monitor. You can place the reflective sticker in the middle of your forehead or glasses or wear the provided baseball cap with built-in reflective marker. You will want to make sure that you are sitting comfortably upright with the sticker at about the same height as the sensor and about 12 to 18 inches away from the monitor. The further back you are from the monitor, the more head movement you will need to control the cursor. To calibrate the software, open the SmartNav program. Move your head all the way to the left, to the right, up and down. You will see the cursor moving within the camera view window. You have a few options for clicking. You can use a regular mouse, any other type of switch input, a hot key like the enter key, voice command, a foot switch, or a dwell click, which we will now demonstrate. To enable dwell clicking, check the dwell clicking box and the toolbar will pop up. You can now alternate between a left or right click, double clicking, and dragging. The default option is represented in blue and the one-time click option is represented as a dashed outline. Now all you need to do to produce a click is to hover the cursor over your intended target. To type, pull up the on-screen keyboard through your ease of access settings as you normally would. Select each letter using dwell click. Some people like to use the word prediction or scanning options available on the on-screen keyboard, but you can also type out each individual letter. There are a few other helpful options to help you customize your SmartNav under the Settings tab. Changing the responsivity level gives you more control over how the software reads and interprets your head movement. If you have limited head and neck mobility, you may want to increase the responsivity level so that the program picks up on more of your head movements. Alternatively, if you have difficulty keeping your head still, Setting the level to smoother allows the program to filter out extraneous, unintended movements. You can also turn on the gravity control, which automatically pulls your cursor to the closest icon or button. This feature allows you to more easily access your intended target. Finally, to avoid unintentional clicks, you can pause while clicking when it's not needed using the on-off tab on the toolbar. For more product information, tutorials, troubleshooting, or to purchase the software, you can visit the SmartNav by Natural Point website.